around and call 911? Hey, what's going on in here? I heard you were thinking of calling 911? Do you know what happens when you call 911? Well, hey guys, what are you doing here? Hi, April. We were just hoping that you could walk us through what happens when a call comes into the 911 center. Well, I would love to. When a call comes into 911, the first thing we ask is, 911, where is your emergency? The most important thing for you to know is your home address. Do you know your address? I sure do. But what if someone is not at home when they need 911 help? Great question. 911 operators may ask you to read nearby signs or describe what you see in order to find your location. You may feel scared or nervous to call 911, but don't worry, 911 operators are trained to help. You can trust us. Just stay calm and explain exactly what's happening. What about practicing or pretending to dial as a joke? 911 is for emergencies only. Joking about an emergency can delay help for someone else. And that's not funny. How do I know if it's an emergency? Well, if a person is sick, you see them get hurt. Oh, no, please. You see a fire or a bad person doing a crime, you can certainly call. Or you can check with an adult just in case. If you dial 911 by mistake, don't hang up. We may think there's an emergency and send a responder to you. Just stay on the line and explain what happened. So you see, Isabel, it isn't funny to call 911. You don't want to delay services to someone that needs that help. You could delay a fire truck, an ambulance, or the police department getting to those people that need help. 911, where's your emergency? Please? No, we cannot send the fire department to get a cat out of the tree because you saw a video on in the internet. I know how to get the cat down from the tree. 